Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Technology and today in this video tutorial, I will show you guys how to disable or remove unnecessary packages or apps in your Windows 11 computer. So you just need to follow me. So firstly, what you have to do, you just need to create a restore point. So if anything goes wrong, you can easily recover your uh, PC with that restore point. So for that, you just need to go to your start menu and type over here, create a restore point. Okay. Now click over here and after that you will get this system properties. Now you just need to click on this create button to create a restore point. Type any name over here like I will put over here technology test and after that click on create and as you can see restore point is creating so you have to wait for a few seconds or minutes. So after restore point created successfully, close this window. After create restore point, you just need to go to your start menu. Type over there power cell. Now right click on windows power cell and click on run as administrator. After that click on yes. Once it will open power cell window, you just need to put some command over here, which I'll give you on my video description. So here's a command to install debloat. After copy, right click over here, it will automatically paste the command and after that press enter from your keyboard. Now it will show you this window. So the first if you want to disable the Cortana, then you can easily disable from here. As you can see it is showing here Cortana has been disabled. If you want to uninstall OneDrive from your system, then you can click over here. So after that you will get an option called disable telemetry task. So this is a very important step. It will disable all kind of uh, background tracking services which is run by Microsoft. So if you want to disable it, then you just need to click on disable telemetry task. So here you will get an option called deploat options. Under that you will get an option called remove all bloatware. So I will suggest you to click on custom block list and select all the unnecessary apps and packages and after that you just need to click on remove bloatware with custom block list and you are done so i hope this quick tutorial will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button like button and share button and if you have any questions or questions then comments down below i will see you guys on the next one next video till then bye bye take care